Hello friend, this is Sonam. Today in this video, we will discuss how to copy a SharePoint folder from one location to another. Uh, this tutorial will cover what is a copy folder. There is a folder that named copy folder. So we will discuss here what is a copy folder action and also we will see how to use this action. We can copy a folder uh, from one document library to another SharePoint location to another SharePoint location using Power Automate flow. So first we will discuss what is a copy folder action. In Power Automate there is an action under the SharePoint connector named a uh, copy folder that is used to copy a folder from a source lo location to destination location. So in this uh, action we have to insert the current site address that means the um, source location, source SharePoint address and then the folder to copy. So we have to insert here file identifier and then destination site address to where we will we want to uh, install copy that folder where we want to for place this folder so we need to gi give here uh, in uh, the destination site SharePoint site address and as well as the destination folder so if you want to insert this folder uh, to into a folder so we need to here insert the destination folder or also we want to uh, here we will insert a action uh, sorry insert we here we need to pick an option uh, there are various type of action option so we need to uh, choose an option to work with this uh, folder so to work with this action so uh, here i have created a manually trigger flow that means a button flow i have created so once the button uh, once we tap the tap on the full once we trigger this flow it will get that metadata from the folder and then it will copy that folder from source location to destination location let's configure this for actions and see how to work with this so here i just uh, log in my office uh, microsoft office tenant address with the office.com so once it will open logged in then it will let's go to that app launcher here we will find all the dynamic 365 application and next we will get uh, one uh, to create the flow we need to open that power automate so click on the ellipses and go to the open in new tab then next uh, we will open the SharePoint so here I just uh, opened my SharePoint so to SharePoint address or you can or you can create in within one SharePoint address you can uh, insert the two folders sorry two document libraries uh, here I just opened one other SharePoint address uh, SharePoint site that SharePoint guides and uh, one is mine SharePoint site SharePoint site so that's one so first we will go to that uh, we will open that power automate application in this application we will create an instant cloud flow click on that so here we will give a name to our instant cloud flow suppose uh, coffee folder copy sharepoint folder so next we will click uh, choose the trigger that manually trigger a flow so every time we need to click on that uh, flow to trigger then click on create so now our trigger is ready no need to insert anything uh, here so next we will click on new step and here we will insert another action that to get the metadata get folder metadata so it will uh, get we, whatever we will insert the folder it will get that folders metadata so here this one is in under the uh, sonom site so uh, there is a, a there is a SharePoint uh, there is a document library named file storage under that fi file storage there is a file uh, section uh, there is a folders named file so here it there it has some documents so next we will then here we need to to get the metadata so here we need so usually here we need to insert the source SharePoint address site address so uh, here is the SharePoint site address so num so select the file identifier so here is our file identifier under that file storage we need to insert the files under file storage we need to insert the file so now it's ready and then we will go insert uh, another action that is uh, the copy folder 
once it will get the metadata folder metadata it will copy the folder so here we get this uh, action uh, under the share point so here we need to insert the site current site address like uh, uh, so this one is share point guides so here it is the asking all it, it is asking for current site address so my current site address is it's mine uh, so sonam then copy the folder so here we will insert the file identifier from i like uh, id from the get folder metadata then destination site address so destination site address is my another sharepoint site address that is sharepoint guides or you can insert the same site address with a destination folder another folder next here we will insert the share destination folder so we just insert that shared document so it will only so the folder will copy to this location so next uh, if the folder is already there if another folder is there then what we will do to copy with a new name other you can insert the replace so it will the replace that folder and fail this action if the folder is already there then it will fill this action fail this action otherwise it will copy with a name so we will copy with another new name select this and then now that's it uh, let's save this flow and test it manually it will check all the permission level otherwise we have to authenticate it we have to configure this uh, let's click on continue then click on the run flow and then done so we, uh, now we can see the flow ran successfully that means our folder is co copy from one location source location to destination location uh, let's see whether it is copy or not this is my source share point address and uh, this one for the file storage is my source uh, the document library and then we will see here it is now it's yeah a few seconds ago now it's done uh, let's see whether there is document or not yes it's in uh, it's copy the folder includes including all the files to the to our destination flow folder so this is how we can copy a sharepoint folder to from one location to another location and i hope uh, you guys uh, enjoy this video and get some ideas from this video if you like my video uh, please like uh, share and subscribe to our youtube channel that is ts info technologies for more videos tutorial on sharepoint power apps power automate power bi python and many more please subscribe to our youtube channel and thank you so much for your time and have a good day bye